Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back on my YouTube channel. I am Gonae and in today's video we are back for another chapter of the vintage journey. Quick reminder of what my vintage journey is. It's basically me trying some old stuff that I have in my dressing and trying to figure out what I decide to keep and what I decide to sell on my vintage that you can find in the description. I don't have anything to add to this, so let's go. <laughs> and we start with an item. I have no idea of what I'm going to choose for this one. It's this very long top. It's super comfy. I have nothing to complain about this. It has short sleeves and I don't feel them at all. I'm not a huge fan of the color, but depending on what you pair this with, it can be nice and something very particular with this top is the back. Here it is. And as you can tell, it's very original very sexy we love that but will it be enough for me to keep that i don't know this is where i need you guys i don't have so much things to say about that because there is no size on it there is no brand on it except this black part here and the beautiful lacing on the back I, I really don't have much more to say, uh, so I'm going to show you a little bit closer. Okay, so I need you. What do you think? Should I keep it? Should I sell it? What do you think? I need help, please. <laughs> You may have guessed it, uh, but it's a surprise. No size, no brand once again, but I really liked this one. I'm pretty disappointed because I kind of feel like I'm not making it justice. In my memories, I I remember this as being stunning. I mean, the color is amazing. It sleeves this. I love that. I think it looks so sexy and we all love sexiness. But, you know, I don't know. I kind of have an expectation versus reality moment. And uh, I don't know, I kind of feel like this looks weirder than in my memories. I kind of feel like it doesn't look as good on me as I remember, but I do love this top. So I'm, I have mixed feelings about this. Once again, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. If you guys have an opinion to share with me maybe it could help it's with this amazing golden color with this glittery uh, details on it you have an under layer we love this if it was see-through here it would have been such a big deal for me uh, in my opinion because on this part uh, you have some padding inside and so what needs to be hidden is being hidden so we're good you have this cute lacing here and on the back it's like this what do you guys think I'm going to show you the details So once again, surprise! Ooh, I hope this video is not gonna be only surprise stuff because 
it's not gonna be very productive if it's gonna be like this. This one is pretty casual compared to what we can see on my YouTube channel usually. This is from the brand Inextenso. It's a 34 slash 36, which is a small size. I don't have so much to say about that, except this part here. I think this is the only thing that is a little bit I would say unusual, but it's not so unusual, it's just that I don't find any other word. It's cute, it's this V shape here, I like this shape, but except from that, that's the only detail that can differentiate this top from another, or maybe the length because it's not that long, but taking in account the fact that it's a 34, I think that's more because of that, because the sleeves are just the right size and if I'm like, it goes a little bit up and one centimeter is missing here after. It's not such a big deal, uh, it's not the comfiest uh, top in my opinion, it's not uncomfy on the back I'm showing you, but it's very simple. The color itself is very basic I and mean black. So I'm going to give a try to this one because sometimes we like to have more casual stuff. I mean, it can look good with some other stuff. You don't need to be in full originality all the time. So sometimes I like to have more casual stuff just in case. So details. I don't have that many things to say about that. I said details, but there's only one thing that is worth seeing. So that was pretty quick. So time will tell. I'm going to give this a try and we shall see. Next, this one is a no size, no brand, no tags. I don't have that many information to give you guys. But here it is with this uh, very nice décolleté. So it's not vulgar, but I think it's pretty sexy. I really like the color as well. This top is super soft. Uh, I think it's pretty comfy. One issue I have with this one is this. That being said, I really like how you have those cute designs here and you have the black color uh, on other parts of this. I think that's pretty original but not too much. I kind of want to give this a try too. I'm going to show you the details. So yeah, I'm going to give this a try too and we shall see what I think about this. Next! Okay, I think this one is really interesting. Look how original this is. I really like this, I think it looks interesting. These details here, I don't know how it's called those here, I'm going to show you one now. When you see the details, you'll saw it a little bit closer. It has some corset vibes to it while being a belt. I'm all into it. It has this nice but not vulgar décolleté. It has short sleeves. I feel them a little bit, but it's not such a big deal for me because it's not extra uncomfy. This here is fitting like a glove. Here it is on the back, as you can tell, there's this really cute bow. I love this originality, cuteness, sexiness, all into one piece. So this top is from the brand Jennifer. It's a size small and 
yeah, I I think even the designs on it are so like modern. I really like this top, and uh, yeah, I think I should show you the details a little bit closer. I really like this. I like the whole thing. I have nothing to say about that. So I'm definitely keeping that. And I think you'll catch me wearing this um, in the future. I have some things that I'm still doubting about, but for now I'm selling like literally nothing. <laughs> Next. So. I really like this item. I think it's really sexy. I wish those were a little bit longer though because it's kind of hard to put this at the right place since this is like holding it back and so you don't have uh, all the freedom you'd like to get with this top. But I really think all the details, the color, those straps here. I know you can move them and all that kind of stuff but this is pretty short as you can probably tell and on the back it's like this. It's pretty simple on the back. What makes the most of it is the fact that it's off the shoulder and it has those cute little details here but the car is a very classic black. I don't blame it. I love it this way. I think it looks classy like that. Anyway, this is from the brand Jennifer once again, but this is a medium size. It's really comfy when it deals with how it feels on the skin, but the fact that this here cannot be like properly put in place makes it a little bit less comfy because you feel like every time you're going to move a little bit too much it's not gonna stay in place and this is not something you want so it's elastic -y a little bit but uh, every time you see <laughs> it does that every time you want to put this at the right place and then here it's at the right place and when I try to put it like come on it can't reach you see I don't know if you can tell the idea is amazing but the person who materialized it um, I don't know how her shoulders are but I kind of feel like they're like straight <laughs> I'm going to show you the details And it's not easy to put it back. So I'm keeping this one, but Jennifer, you did not do an amazing job on this one. I'm sorry, that's a 9 out of a 10 for me. It would have been perfect if these were a little bit longer. Next, <laughs> this is a size one. I don't know if it's a medium or a small. I never managed to remember what a size one is. I never remember what the the equivalence is. So size one. <laughs> anyway, I kind of like it. It's very comfy. It has short sleeves. I can feel the sleeves a little bit, but it's not such a problem for me. I really love the black color with this popping design on it. It has some fake diamonds on it. I think that's cute. You also have a small design on the back. It goes a little bit puffy at the bottom but not too much. It's elastic -y here. It's very very soft. I love 
how it feels on my body. I don't have much more to say, so let's see the details. Once again, this one stays with me. I kind of feel like at this point, I'm not going to sell anything. Uh, that's gonna be just a, hey, look at what I have in my dressing <laughs> type of videos. But yeah, maybe you like this too. I don't know, just let me know what you like, what you don't like. I'm very curious. I'm keeping this one too. Last top for this video. This is from the brand Camayeu, it's a size 2 and it looks pretty basic at first sight but if you look more in details you see all those cuttings here and it goes up to this part of the stop on the back it's like this and it goes a little bit like a V for the color it's pretty comfy it's not the comfiest top in the world but I mean I don't feel uncomfy in this but yeah I'm going to show you a little bit closer this one will go on my vintage because even if it's original I don't feel like keeping it so this one will be the first item of this video to join my vintage. <laughs> this cute little skirt has no size on it, no brand on it. I think it's super cute. I don't know what you guys think of it, but here it is. It's not too short but it's not too long. I like that it has this cute little belt here. Um, honestly, it's just an accessory. It's not useful because it's like elastic -y on this part and it stays in place without a belt. So it's cute and it's just here to be cute. But I really like this large black band here and the fact that you have this cute tiny belt that reminds us of the skirt itself is just so great i really like this here it is on the back it's really comfy when i think about that kind of skirt i always think about something that stays perfectly in place and like nothing is moving here you can move around and the skirt is moving around too it's really soft i really like how it feels let's see this cutie a little bit closer so yeah i'm keeping this next last item of this video this is this jean here it's like this is from a brand called fashion studio i don't think this is a famous brand i don't even know if this brand is still a thing today or not but you have the informations <laughs> uh, that i can give you this is a 38 uh it's pretty pretty much simple you have pockets here you can wear a belt with it and on the back here is where it's getting interesting with those cute little details on the pockets that are super cute I'm going to show you a little bit closer because I genuinely don't know what to say else so let's go oh maybe I forgot to mention that's 38 equals medium size so if i forgot there is the information because i know for this sizing <laughs> yeah time for the details i 
I'm not going to keep this one. Finally, I'm not keeping two items in this video, so that's pretty great. Uh, not that I want to get rid of absolutely everything in my dressing, but since I wanted to change a lot of things before I can welcome new stuff, I have to get rid and make space for that. Maybe you guessed it, but chances are I'm going to make videos about some stuff that are going to take place in my dressing in the future. So if you want to see that, don't forget to subscribe. So that was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free to subscribe to my channel. If you're interested in joining me on my YouTube journey, I'm planning to do plenty of different videos on here. And uh, as usual, thank you so, so much for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, everything. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye. Mwah.